Hey everyone. Today I'm gonna play at dead of night on Intel G41 and show you how to boost the FPS. Before boost the FPS, it's giving me about 5 to 10 FPS. But after it give me the maximum FPS I can get. Actually this game is not a 100% game. It's a video. Because of that, the maximum FPS we can get is 30. I know I said 60 in the thumbnail. It actually gives 60 FPS. But it's only for the cursor and other user interfaces like inventory. For the gameplay, it only gets up to 30 FPS. And also I have to say, on some PCs, the game will stuck at loading. I will tell you how to fix it. So let's begin. First of all I will tell how to fix the loading screen. The best way to fix it is updating your graphic driver. It worked on my PC. Also if your RAM is too low, like 2 GB, you have to set more virtual memory. At least 4 GB. This is how you do it. If that didn't work, the last thing is try the ready boost. You can do it like this. Now it should work. Alright. I'm gonna show you the FPS I can get without reducing quality. I'm sorry, FPS monitoring softwares doesn't work on this game. There are no graphic settings for this game. Anyway, let's give it a try. As you can see, it's very laggy. It's not completely unplayable. But it's kinda hard to play. Let's try our old medicine for this. I mean reducing the resolution. Go to games location. Then go to package.nw. Now open up this file with notepad. In order to change the resolution, you have to change the resolution here. And here. And here. Good. Now try the game. As you can see, it's nothing. Just the same FPS. Very laggy. So our old techniques doesn't work on this game. Let's try something else. Now take a look at this. The size of the game. It's nearly 4.75 GB. Keep that in mind. Now go to package.nw and then media. Now take a look at this. The size of video files. It's nearly 4.3 GB. So now we can agree that the whole game is just a video. As you can see there are three videos in it. This one is the intro.
um, just. And this is the tutorial. And here you can see hotel.m4v. And its size is 4.1 GB. And that's the entire game. These videos are 1080p. Okay. Before we go there, I'm gonna explain how this works. Now I have this video. It's an example video for a 4K video. As you can see it's 4K. And also it's 60 FPS. Now let's see if this video actually plays in 60 FPS. Well, it doesn't seems like 60 FPS. You can see here it says actual FPS. It's not 60. Now think about how you play it in 60 FPS. In that game, we tried reducing resolution and playing it. Let's try that on a video. I'm gonna reduce the resolution to 800x600. See. It's still playing at 4K and I can't change it like that. So how you reduce the quality in a video? Easy. Just use a video editor or a simple software like this. It's called Handbrake. I always use this. You can download it from the description. Drag and drop the video on here. Now go to Dimensions tab. Here you can see the resolution we need. I'm gonna make it 720p. Remember this. When you change the resolution, don't change width. Just change the height. Now look here. There's a automatically generated width showing here. Type that as width. Now go to Video tab. Select the FPS. Always try to select the FPS that the original video has. That video had 60 FPS. So I'm gonna make it 60. It's a constant frame rate too. Now here you can select the compression rate. You can make the process faster by making it low compression. Or you can highly compress the video. But takes so long to finish. Now save the files wherever you want and hit start. It will take some time. This is finished video file. Let's try if it's playing in 60 FPS or not. Great. As you can see now it's running smoothly.
the actual FPS is 60 now. We have to do the same thing to the game. This file is the whole game. If we lower the quality in this video, we can play it smoothly. Now drag and drop it here. Go to the dimensions tab. Now you have to choose a resolution. I'm gonna use 480p. If your PC is better than mine, you might be able to play it in 720p. Now change the height. Then look over here and type the width. Then go to the video tab. Let me check out the frame rate real quick. As you can see, it's constant 30 FPS. Now select them. I'm gonna use ultra fast compression cause this is gonna take so much time. Check fast decode. And now save the file. Here is the important thing. When you save the file, do this. Change MP4 to M4V. Also change the name to Hotel. Don't save it on the same directory that the source video is in. Now, hit start. As you can see it's gonna take a long time. I already did it. Here is the file. Now before do anything, I'm recommending to move the original file to somewhere in case you need it. Now move low quality file here. You can also do the same thing to these two files. Now let's check out the performance.
as you can see it's so smooth but it's gonna get a bit laggy at the start up but it's gonna fix automatically after you play it for a while also some lag spikes will happen when you use the spirit receiver for the first time it will get better So that's all for today's video. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Grab the subscribe button. Join me on Telegram for discussions. I'm gonna see you, in the next one.